gonna be the second video. We got it somewhat buffed out. Paint's looking a lot better. Still got some places where it has um, surface rust around, so obviously we're not gonna be able to fix that. Right now, get Garrett inside, um, cleaning up all like the vinyl and, and stuff with this vinyl cleaner that we got. The back seat's in really good shape. Just gonna wipe it, wipe it down, and everything. Uh, probably headliner's not gonna be able to be cleaned really, but it's not dirty, so we're not gonna worry about that. It's a roof. Let's see, what we got. This back one, you can see we got it shined up pretty, pretty well. Still gotta work on. Metal on the sides, get it all polished up real nice. Kind of vacuum it out. The floor's looking a little rough. But, um, definitely got to clean up these wheels, get those hubcaps polished up, and clean those tires because they've just been sitting and all that crap on them all this time. But, paint's not looking too too bad. Definitely a lot better. Got, really got to clean up this front metal on the front here. I haven't worked on that at all yet. Got the front bumper shine. Still needs to be cleaned up a little bit. But overall, still cleaning it up today. Um, gonna go pick up, hopefully pick up that get a fuel line made for it tomorrow. See if we can get it started up. But just cleaning off the seats. Got the door inside of the doors cleaned off. Pretty, kind of pretty clean actually. Some cigarette trays. Back seat. I'll show you how that seat lays flat. Let me scoot this seat up real quick. Hop in, pull the lever and slide the seat forwards. Cleaning up all the doors, getting still cleaning it up. Gonna vacuum it out probably. Still got some dirt in it and stuff. But y'all y'all keep watching our videos and you'll see how it transforms. Show you one thing that I thought was pretty interesting about some of this paperwork that we have. I actually have this little book that says what to do in case of an accident. Uh, keep this in your keep this booklet in the pocket of your car. You open it up and it um, gives you options of what what to do if certain things happen. So safety rules. Let's, first aid. So say we go to first aid. Let's just, that one first aid send for the doctor at once do not move injured keep injured warm by covering with blankets or coats do not give unconscious person anything by mouth if bleeding stop by pressure or tourniquet there's some pretty some pretty cool papers in here got some different things here and there but I 
that's pretty much it. Still working on cleaning it up. Just a lot of time to buff it all out and stuff. But we'll get her cleaned up nice and good. Hopefully I can show you all a video of it running here shortly. Hopefully I can get that fuel line tomorrow. And, um, I'll be able to show y'all what this thing sounds like. If I can um, show you actually what, what we're needing. See this hard line right here? Let's see if we can focus. There we go, right there, that hard line has a rubber hose that goes from there down into this right here. Feeds into the bottom of that, which fills up your, your fuel bowl. And then that's your fuel pump mounted on the side. Pump it up to the car and get her cranked up. But fires with gas in the car, but obviously we don't have any fuel getting to it from the tank, so it doesn't keep running. So, new battery, of course. I'll let y'all know how it how it goes. I'll probably post another video tomorrow or the next day, um, showing some more progress that we've got. But until that fuel line gets, it, until I go get that fuel line, we won't be able to do very much. Thanks for watching our videos. Stay tuned.